The state command of the Nigerian Security and Civil Defense Corps, NSCDC, has arrested two alleged child traffickers in the Okolowo community area of Ilori, the Kwara state capital, who lure their victims into prostitution. The public relations officer of the command, Olasukomi Ayeni, disclosed this while briefing journalists at the command headquarters on Thursday, disclosing that one of the underage trafficked girls by name Ogechuku Alo, age 17, escaped from the hotel where she was lured into prostitution before reporting to the command on the activities of the syndicates. The NSCDC spokesman, Olasukomi Ayeni, said six underage girls were rescued following a tip-off. I was uh, informed of uh, a deception through one girl, uh, Okechuku Halo, a 16 years old, who claimed that she was deceived from an umbrella state, that she'd be given a job that would fetch her 50,000 naira monthly. And through that, she came to Ilori. While getting to Ilori, the suspect, who is uh, still at large, blessing Chioma, uh, lure her into prostitution at the Yabo guest house in Okolo. The girl has been there. She claimed sometimes she attends to between 5 to 17 men on a daily basis. We are going to uh, release them to NAPTIP for diligent prosecution. The alleged traffickers, however, insist that their victims bought into the idea of going into prostitution willingly with the consent of their sisters. The NRDCDC advised parents on the need for effective monitoring of their daughters to avoid falling victims of persons who may want to influence them negatively. Get here, but it's not what you told me for our side that I see. Now show work where you bring me. He used to give me 20 condoms. 20 condoms. Inside that 20 condoms, sometimes I just sleep with 10 men, 15, 17. It's really very disheartening, considering the fact that our young children are being used for prostitution. The parents on their part should engage their children. They should ensure they send these children to... Former Governor of Ekiti State, Kayade Fayemi, and other stakeholders in the political and educational sectors are recommending high commitment to fulfilling the social contract between rulers and followers as panacea to solving the mirage of problems facing the Nigerian political and territorial space. The call was made at a federal university, Oyekiti, during the 15th inaugural lecture of the institution delivered by Professor Taju Olanio. The deputy vice-chancellor of the university who represented the vice-chancellor pointed at leadership failure, state fragility and too much power centered at the federal level as part of reasons why sections are frequently agitating for separation. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.